Hello, this is a really basic guide to WordPress uh, search engine optimization using a plugin by this chap called Yoast. So I've installed the plugin and so far I've, I've just added a title to my web page, nothing else. Once you've done that, save it, save your web page. And I, I shortened the, um, the URL. If you click this edit button, you can shorten the URL there just to make it a bit shorter. So what you want to do if you, once you've installed the plugin and you've, you've started to make a page, scroll down your page and look for this WordPress SEO by Yoast. And one of the things you need to do first is to have some focused keywords. So these are the main keywords that your web page is going to be about. So what are we going to be? Right, this is what my focus keywords are. It's dog walking in Bradford. Now when I did that, it's, it's found other things that people have searched for. So people have searched for dog walking services, dog walking jobs, things like that. So that just gives you a few hints if you need some. So next we need an SEO title. So that's the one that um, I've already put in the title of my page but we can put it here as well and then we need a description down here now this is just a uh, a really brief description of what your page is about but search engines like this description so we put that in the description box so just describe in a few words what your what your website web page is about you want to have your search term this um, focus keywords you want these keywords here or this uh, they call it a string keyword string in here as well and that makes sure that Google knows what your web page is about so now if you look here it's telling you things it says uh, your focus keywords are in your heading your title your URL we've not got any content yet so it's not there and it's in our meter description so next we'll put some content in the page now I've already made some content so I'll just copy and paste it paste it in there and then we'll update again there we go then we'll click this SEO check button here it takes us down the page and if you look here th there's different tabs that's the one we were using last time and this is the um, page analysis now if you click that page analysis you get these buttons and these can be all different colors but what you want is to make sure all these buttons have gone green and it gives, tells you what to do to make it um, uh, to sort of improve the search engine optimization of your web page things like uh, the keyword phrase appears in the URL the URL is the the, the, um, the thing like Microsoft.com Windows 95 or whatever it's, it's the uh, um, the name of the page uh, what else have we got keyword appears in the first paragraph of the copy keyword density you don't want to have it too many you don't want to have your keywords too many times in the page because Google will think you're, you're spamming uh, there's a thing called spam dexing which is a bit like spam email but it's just spamming the uh, the search engines but if you read through all of these and whatever it says needs doing then change it this particular one here it says that um, there's a stop word if you look in our um, keywords here that that in the word in you don't actually need that because Google will ignore it but it looks a lot more natural dog walking in Bradford than dog walking Bradford it's not easy to write a page about an old page about dog walking Bradford and especially when you want to put things in your page because what you're doing this if you look down here um, you'll see several occurrences what we'll do we'll update that and then we'll look at it on, a, on the actual web page that it's going to be on so if we view the post and then we click find see as you go through it tells you where it um, Right, so there's a one there which says dog walking in Bradford. Then there's one there, one there, one there, 
button there and that tells Google Google sees all these this same string of text and knows that that's what your web page is about so basically that's how it's done I don't want to keep it too long because we've gone uh, over five minutes already but that's basically how it's done and this plugin if you don't know how search engine optimization works this plugin helps you to to sort of get started to make sure you're getting you doing things right from the beginning well thanks for watching and I do hope to see you again soon bye